Hi, I'm Jeff Johnson, Installer Sales Specialist with Unirec. I'm here to talk to you today about how we have combined the leader in metal roof attachments, it's S5, with the leader in solar racking equipment, that's Unirec. We're going to walk through a brief installation of rails on a standing seam roof. I do want to run through the parts of the system here. Uh, we did just assemble this L foot, that's going to be your L foot and your S5 standing seam clamp. We have the Unirac Universal Aesthetic Fastener or UAF mid and end clamps. This is your end clamp right here and your mid. These are universal pieces, can be used any size mod that you need. We're also gonna have some T-bolts and some Unirac rails back there. All right, without further ado, let's go get on the roof. I've got my first markings here of that edge, 24 inches and 24 inches there. At this point, all you need to do is position it where your rail needs to go and torque it into place. You'll repeat this process all the way across the roof for every, uh, every attachment point, and then we can start putting rails on. This is gonna be the Unirac SM standard rail, and we're gonna utilize the Unirac T-bolt as well. You'll see these little indicator marks on the top of our T-bolts. That's how you're gonna know that it's properly engaged. You're gonna wanna see that being perpendicular to the rail. And it's just that easy. Panel installation for these is fairly simple. For these end clamps, what you'll do, install them facing down, twist them over into place, and then I want you to push down on the front end of it until it meets the panel frame. Then you can go ahead and tighten it in place. And there you go. So you twist it up, push on the front end, and then it's ready. Similar process for the mid clamps as well. We'll twist these into place, and then you can just let them rest right there against the panel frame while you go get your next one. And I like to hold them together just for some stability as you tighten it down. Then you can just rinse and repeat for the rest of your system till you get to the other end. And at that point, it's all in clamps. All right guys, there you have it. You can see how simple this install is gonna be on a larger scale, right? You have a lot of pieces that uh, either get assembled on the ground or assembled very quickly on the roof. Good luck out there.